my lovely Sagittarians, welcome to your next six month reading. Yes, six months from the time you view loves. We are in mid May recording this reading, or it could be as we speak by the end of the year. Let's tell us what the energies are and how this will reflect on you, what this will bring to you as many many sages are knowing that certain things definitely this year are will turn in a whole different way than probably been planned so let's see loves general energy for all of you looking for the next six months eight of wands five of wands power and justice underneath we have an ace of cups yes i see a lot of movement i see some upside downs turnings you know twists i see definitely here you you might let go certain people from your life the month of October, November will be crucial months for many, many of you, Sag. But definitely I see certain things that are start moving into your life. At the one point, might be a little too much out there because I see a lot of things coming in, coming, coming. Make sure whatever you are going through or gonna do to be in a balanced way. For some of you, Sages, especially entrepreneurs or those of you who are, um, you know, self-taught or you working for yourself, I definitely see here certain things coming into you and feels very unexpected to you. Try to keep yourself in balance or try to not put anything close to your heart what i mean through that sagittarius is more likely that you know everybody has an opinion out there everybody has a wish and everybody think their ways you stay true to yourself because whatever here is coming not everyone will be in the same boat as you are or on the same boat as you want to be so certain things here will come to you and definitely will need to be in a, in a frequency of balance. All right, loves. But definitely I see a lot of movement and certain, certain things that are coming to you might be kind of like, what? I didn't really expect to that. And for some of you Sages, avoid conflicts that's very very important whatever you do whoever you communicate definitely we are different we have an opinion but certain things here definitely might not work with certain people does not mean they are bad people does mean you you have your thing they have their things so let it be okay loves but i also see here new things new energies especially for those of you single sagittarius you might be quite surprised when somebody might enter your life okay i definitely see here some some sages will have you know people who they talk and somebody here definitely will be there for them four of swords world six of swords and the knight of wands so look at here loves for some of you if you will close certain doors to whomever it's for your own good because world definitely speaks of certain things definitely needs to end to get in a better place or in a in a more even place okay and for some of you closing certain doors you will avoid some things that are definitely heavier to handle because look at here four and six of swords it's the ten of swords so you don't want to get in this ten of swords 
So whatever it's there, whomever you are dealing, whatever people you have in your life, think wisely and then do. It's kind of like I'm thinking, what should I do? But it's better to move forward from this person or this people or this particular energy. Okay. The tower moment, I will clarify really quick, chariot. Whatever is there, whatever here is, it's kind of giving you a breakthrough movement. So whatever here feels like, you know, it's the end of the world. Actually, it's the beginning of something great for you. What's at this five of wands, people? This ten of swords, king of cups, death. Seven of Cups, Hangman, and the Hermit. So what I'm seeing here, whatever breakthrough here is, is definitely here you, you are not quite sure. This Ten of Swords anyway will feel like it's happening, okay? Will feel like it's happening. Could be from a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or a Virgo for some of you. I have a lot of water energy. I, I, I have a lot of things here that feels like, you know, I reflected. I'm feeling stuck. What should I do? I'm going away. I'm moving forward. So for some of you, definitely whoever you are letting go, you are letting go for a good reason. Okay. Definitely here, it's like whatever, whomever comes here my put you to think, might make you emotional. But indeed here, for some of you, whoever will show up at your door or whoever tries to contact you or say certain things, it's more likely you don't expect them, but I definitely see here movement. I also see here some sages. There is a major move out there in your life. Could be a physical move, could be a change of location by the end of the year. I definitely see here a lot of move. Many of you, the move could be on the mental, could be an emotional, but I also see for very, very many Sagittarius, it's a, it's a, it's a physical move out there. I also see here from, from July to November, be careful how you drive or how fast you drive. Check your car if your car has some problems check it and fix it because I definitely see here for some of you it feels like a could be a minor accident of a car and certain things here might definitely needs to be repairs okay I will clarify also this six of swords judgment and press queen of cups and the Four of Swords, Star, Magician, Six of Pentacles, Two of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, and the Wheel. So what I'm seeing here, it's for some of you Sagittarius, if you are single, if you are single, definitely I see someone out there for you which is looking quite beautiful. Could be, for some of you, in a water sign. For others of you, might have very strong water energy. Speaking about water, could be a very emotional energy around that person, or that person could be overly caring, overly being there, and so on. I will also see here if... There is a Sag here who felt stuck. If you felt stuck for a long time, when I mean to a long time, could be two years, could be up to two years, I definitely see here movement forward. 
if you manifest here that movement forward and you could work here and there and you try to meet up the the payments or bills or the wheel of fortune it's kind of by december or i i'm hearing mid december there's a lot of things like starts to show to you it's like one after another one so many many things like you feel like nothing comes or if ever will come they start to pick up one after another one so indeed here there's a lot of things that are opening up for many many of you sages i I don't see any resistance here. So that very, very strongly speaks of for those Sages who've been, you know, resisting certain things. I, I feel here is just kind of like whatever it is, I'll just allow it. And I definitely see here that allowance. The Knight of Wands, Temperance, Lovers, Ace of Swords. So many many things here come in a clear better view to many many sages new energies coming in for many of you and definitely i do see for single sagittarius love this is new love okay It's like choosing to do new things. I will also see for some of you Sages, you... It's like I, I break free with my old me. Whatever that speaks to you. If you feel that certain things you don't want to do anymore, this year will be that time. Or it's like this the last six, uh, six months from this year is just kind of breaking free from the old you whoever you thought the things are better or whoever things have been there not anymore for sages who've been in a third party somebody might return to you but it's kind of same old same old it's like that point is just kind of like i thought you will grow up there's no grow up. I'd rather move forward. It's like that that kind of a thing here that some people never change and will never change. And I feel here once you close that door for good, it's like very, very quick something comes to you or someone comes to you. Because I definitely see here a Sag who... It's kind of been in a back and forth. Maybe, maybe this person will change or maybe this person will make they are right. They might not. Some people never change. And we got to be okay with that. More messages for Sagittarius by the end of the year or this next six months. Three of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. Four of Cups in the Sun. Nine of Wands. As I said, for those of you who've been in a resistance for something new, there's definitely here something coming in. For some of you, there's a, in a form of abundance. For others of you, there's a new beginning in love, which in the first place, you might not really be into that new energy. But the Sun really speaks of feels like a rebirth feels like something that you always were looking for so enjoy the new you but leave the old behind and for some of you job wise there's something here you definitely will start doing and it seems here quite quite abundant there's certain new responsibilities here for many many of you sages work-wise or money-wise there's indeed here certain things are lifted up for many many of you there is a sage here if you start something here on your own definitely here with the king of pentacles and the emperor this will amplify because i feel here there's something here like a baby idea you start it's growing for those of you who are 
who are given to you a new job or a new offer and you may not feel into. I feel also that this it's escalated pretty quick, pretty fast. And I feel here this is a great opportunity around October or mid-October for that. I also see here quite a breakthrough mid-October, money-wise speaking. For some of you, the earliest you might see around the Lion's Gate. Lion's Gate is happening in in August 8, 8, okay? But I definitely see here the October month very, very strong. What you need to avoid around this time, toxic people or people who are doing things, you know, behind the bars. And it's kind of like be careful around certain things and be aware because they might not be good to you. Certain people here might seem great friends or looks look to be friends with you, but you gotta be very careful because they might not be your friends. So be careful of the people who are coming into your life or who are kind of always there, we always want to come to you, we always want to see you, we always, always is there, or always try to talk to you or know what you're doing. Certain people definitely out there, you, it's not like to avoid, but set healthy boundaries, okay? Also, for those Sagis who are entrepreneurs or doing their own thing, whatever ideas you have, don't share too much because somebody here is there just to steal your idea or just to take something that could be good for you or could be yours. Okay, loves. So be be very much aware of that too. Okay. One advice from our oracles. This is the Denise, Denise Lynn deck. We have overcoming obstacles. You can overcome anything. And definitely you find quite a few great answers out there. Okay. You are exactly where you are, needs to be, and savor your life. Do the things the way you want and feel like so. Live your life the way it is. And definitely there is something new out there that you my definitely consider for yourself which is beautiful i also see here many many of you sagittarius there's a lot of things like finally starts to move forward which is great absolutely great For those of you, what I'm getting here now, there's a message special for some Sag, it's not for, it's not for everyone. There is a Sag here who might go through a legal situation or someone around you. It's kind of like finally will be a, a breakthrough or there is a sudden end of that. Whatever legal situation is, it's kind of like turns out unexpectedly in your favor or turns out unexpectedly in a positive way. So that's kind of like a winning energy comes through. But I feel also that that's come like a surprise, like what? What? But definitely it's kind of like the justice is served out there for whatever it's around. Okay, loves. So, Sagis, that concludes your reading. I hope this brings you the messages you definitely look for. If it does, let us know. Subscribe, like, and share it. And if you need more, look in the description box. We have plenty of information out there. See you, my darlings. Namaste.